White Pass and Yukon Route Railway Building, adjacent to the Visitor Center. Started in May 1898 during the height of the gold rush, the White Pass and Yukon Route Railway was completed in July of 1900, connecting Skagway to Whitehorse, Yukon Territory. The narrow gauge railway was originally intended to help ease the burden of those miners that could actually pay to ride over White Pass to the Yukon River's headwaters. Construction began on May 28, 1898, as the gold rush entered its peak. Over 30,000 men helped with the three phases of the construction, and the first train arrived in Whitehorse on July 30, 1900, far too late to assist prospectors en route to the gold fields. Ironically, it was the railroad, and not the quick riches it was originally built to transport people to, that became the backbone of Skagway's economy for more than 80 years, finally sounding its last whistle in 1982. It reopened in 1988 to serve a new breed of prospector, armed with cameras and camcorders rather than picks and shovels. It probably comes as no surprise that most of the economic transactions that take place in Skagway in the 21st century fall under the category of travel and tourism. Today, the cameras and camcorders have been replaced by compact smartphones that act as both. But a common bond still exists between those miners of the Yukon Gold Rush and the millions of tourists that have followed in their footsteps the quest for a piece of Alaskan treasure that, today, takes the form of a lifetime of memories. <laughs>